Hello, happy gardeners. Welcome back to Stinky Ditch Nursery. We've got Marla on camera. She can't stay away. Say hello, Marla. Hi. She's probably going to still do a bit of a Saturday job, but your job's been put off for a week, hasn't it? Yeah. Oh, well. Doesn't matter. Um, it's, it will happen in the end. Right, what I'd like to talk to her about today are splitting hardy geraniums. Did a little bit of a vid last week about how you can take root cuttings from them. Um, and today we're going to split this in half. Now, Myra, if you'd like to spin in, you can see this is one plant and they've only just, they die back for the winter. So it's only just starting to come up. And you can see it's got lots of growing bits to it like this. Yeah. And what we can do is now, if you've got one of these in the ground, you can um, dig it out of the ground. Nice big spade full like that and, and split it then and then plant them in two different places. You will get more plants. Right. So I'm going to tip it out ever so gently. Oh. There we go. He's out like that. Got a nice few roots there, like that. I'm going to put him like this. And there we are. I'm going to look for a good splitting point now. So let's have a look. I reckon across here. I reckon across there might work. So I'm going to get a nice sharp spade like this. And I'd probably better do this on the ground. No, I'll do it on the table. Let's try it on the table. This could all go horribly wrong. Put a hole in the table. But I, yeah, but there we are. Right, so I'm going to get it there. I'm going to push down gently but firmly. There we go. Right. And now let's have a look at what we've got. So if we open that up like that, you can see half of the roots are for one side of the plant and half of the roots the other. Now we're not going to disturb them too much. Even though hardy geraniums, they are really tough plants and they can take um, a bit of a, a chopping about. Right, so we're going to pop this up. I've just popped this one back up into the pot it came out of. Give it a bit of a tap, give it a bit of a clean. And I'm going to use my normal potting compost that I use for everything. We've got a bit of nutrition in here, a bit of topsoil, a bit of peat. Well, not peat, a bit of recycled grow bag. Um, and uh, have a look at the other videos if you'd like to see how that works. Right, so Marla, you like spin in? Put too much in there now. It's a bit of a lumpy old mix. And I'm going to get the plant itself sort of in the middle of the pot and make sure that when we put it in there we leave about an inch at the top like this because then the water when you water it can sit on the top and soak in to the um, to the pot itself and uh, a bit more of that around the outside I'm making the right pig's ear of this but there we go it doesn't really matter push him down a bit push him down like that and there we are Ta-da! We made two plants. So uh, I'll pop that one up the same. Um, I, I leave these outside at the moment. Um, they've got a bit of food in the compost, so that will just um, kick off and start growing. And we've expanded our stock and we've got more plants. Anyway, this has been Robbie Phoenix down at Sticky Ditch Nursery with Marla on camera. And uh, oh, I've said this to a couple of people. Have you seen my face mask, Marla? No. Oh. No, I got this new face mask and it was on the side the other day and it only, then occurred to me that it looks like a, a male stripper's bit of underwear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to get a new Mankini. one. Mankini. You know, heterosexual man, I don't want to put that on my face. <laughs> anyway, this has been Robbie Phoenix, down at Stinky Dish Nursery, Marla on camera, uh, showing you how to split your hardy geraniums. Thank you for watching.